Hi, good morning. My name is Neil Murray. I'm the owner and coach of Pius Rugby Training. Here next to me is Leo Morris. He's going to help me again with the exercise videos for today. Uh, first of all, what we're going to do is just a quick warm-up. Uh, so basically throughout the exercises, we're going to start off with the warm-up, then the strengthening exercises, then we're going to end off with the four skills. Okay, so let's just warm up our body a little bit. So what we're going to do is we're going to put your hands around the head like this on the ear side. Right, let's go, other hand. Right, and just, just press against your head, against your uh, hand for five seconds. One, two, three, four, five. Right. Let's take the other hand, your left hand, put it on your right hand side of the head, right here, and press again. One, two, three, four, five. Right, now take both hands, just put it behind your head, and then press, it, press your head backwards against your hand. One, two, three, four, five. Right, now we're going to take both hands against the front of your head, like this. Just press against your hands, forward, one. Two, three, four, five. Right, now we're going to swing the arms a little forward. Swing the arms. One, two, three, four, five. Right, backwards. One, two, three, four, five. Right, now we're going to do some legs. Now, this is going to acquire a little bit of balance. So, parents, you, can, you are allowed to help your kids a little bit to hold them up straight. So what they're going to do is they're going to just take the foot like this at the back and just press it back towards the bum area. I'm going to keep my balance here. <laughs> right, so you're going to press the leg behind the foot like that and just press it towards the bum and keep it there for five seconds. One, two, three, four, five. Right, now, let's take the other leg now. Let's go. One, Two, three, four, five. As you can see, this is a little bit help required for the balance. Right, Leo, take your other foot quickly. Take your other foot. Uh, stretch it. One, two, three, four, five. Right, you can also try to let them do it on their own, just to uh, exercise the balance as well. Um, if they can't do it, they just hold their hand just to do the warm up with the leg stretching. Right, ready? Go. One, two, three, four, five. Right, well done. Right, ready for starting now. Let's go. Okay, so for uh, first warm up, what we're going to do is just get a little bit jumping. So basically, what's going to happen now is uh, Leo's going to hold the ball in both hands. He's going to put his feet together and he's going to jump over each red marker. If you don't have any cones or markers at home, you can use something like shoes or just a piece of uh, firewood. You can just put it, uh, uh, spread it out uh, a feet, two feet apart from each other and then you can just jump over it. Work your feet together like this, like Leo is going to show us now. Ball in both hands, feet together and then jump, jump. Right, are you ready? Go. Turn around. Right. right, so that's the first warm up. You can do that about six times. One that way, two, three, four, five, six. So this morning I record this video. Um, it was recorded in slow motion, which means there was uh, no sound in the recording. And I did speed up the, video, the slow motion video so we can have a normal speed video. So I'm just going to talk you through it quickly. Um, basically, what I said here is that uh, you can need for you need four markers, four, or you can use four shoes or anything to pack out the the uh, rectangle you're gonna. Uh, skip into so basically this is our second uh, warm-up exercises are skipping to the side um, 
yes you can to put it your width can be two more two meters your length can be six meters okay so basically what you're going to do is you're just going to skip like we're doing now in a video uh six times uh one up two down three up four down five up six down and you fa keep facing the one way don't turn around keep facing the one way skip up and down six times then turn around and skip up and down like i'm going to explain in this video now here please make sure parents that they don't cross their legs like that um they need to put their start by start position feet together like i'm going to show you guys now getting Leo out the way there uh, so put your feet next to each other then you take a step to the side and then just jump a little bit into the air and let your feet tap in the middle and take another step to the side so that's what I do is skip in slow motion so you take a step feet together take a step to the side and then you let your feet tap in the middle and then another step to the side that's how you skip right so basically this is it you can uh, do it six times up and down facing the one way six times up and down facing the other way like a nice warm-up i hope this video uh, helped you and enjoy Alright, so for our first strength exercise, we're going to do the crab walk. You also need four cones, four markers, uh, about four meters apart. So it's basically a square. And uh, we're going to do the crab walk three ways walking forward, walking backwards, and walking sideways. Ready? First one, walking forward, and go. When you get to the other side, turn around. Oh. Right. So that's the first one. Now we're going to turn around and walk backwards. bum touch the ground, always keep it in the air. Work on the core and the uh, ab muscles. Go sideways. Sideways one. This one's a little bit more difficult. If you can't do it right away, it's fine. Just let them try the first time. Ready? Go. And back. Crab walk, forward, backwards, and sideways. Enjoy. Right, so for our second strengthening exercise, we're going to do the arm pull. Um, basically what's going to happen now is we're going to hold each other's arms. Then we're going to start pulling each other to the markers behind us. The first one to pull the one to the other marker behind them is the winner. Okay, so we're going to do three ways. Started with the left hand, then the right hand, then both hands. Uh, parents, just remember that, uh, moms, if your arm is too big for the child to grab on, you can just give them two fingers like this. 
So, so they can grab the fingers like that. You can just hold on to the hands and then they can start pulling and you can also just keep them a little bit back so they can use their legs and, uh, and their arms well. They are not allowed to pull in the arms like this. Always keep the arms straight as possible. Keep the body straight and then just use the legs to pull. Okay, don't do this. And if, the, um, if he falls down, uh, if he falls down, you can just wait, help him up on his feet, and then continue pulling. Okay, when you're done, get him to the marker behind you, you swap to the right hand, to the other hand, and you do the same. Right, off the right hand, you do both hands, grab, just grab the hands like this, cross, and then you pull. Okay, right. Left hand first, grab the hands like that, ready, and go, pull, 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 go Leo, let's go, use the leg, always try to use the leg, pull, 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 let the feet dig in, let's go, pull, 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 go, 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 don't stop Leo, don't stop, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, go, 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 I'm almost there, I'm almost there, well done. Perfect. So you can do the left arm three times, the right arm three times, and both hands three times. Right, let's do the right hand, right arm. The arm pull. Ready, and... Ready, and go. Go. Use the legs, use the legs. Always try to use the legs. Keep going, get the legs. Use the legs, use the legs. Go, 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 if they pull backwards, let them just fall backwards a little bit and then let them use the legs. Don't let them fall on their bum. Right, pull. Use the legs. Go. Use the legs. Go. 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 Pull. 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 Let's go. Let's go. Almost there. Let's go. 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 Keep going, Leo. Keep going. Almost there. Well done. There you go. Right, so that's for a strength exercise, the arm pull, friends, about three of each, lateral arm uh, leg exercises, well done Leo Key. enjoy. Right, for our first um, core skill exercise, today we're going to use the driving bag, also known as the shield. Um, friends, if you don't have a driving bag or a shield at home, you can always try to take a pillow just to, with a rope around it so you can hold it at the back like this so they can run into the, uh, into the driving bag or the shield. So if you don't have one of these, you can always try to take a, a, a pillow uh, with a rope around it, two ropes around it, or just one loop rope and just put it around the pillow so you can hold it like that nice and tight so they can run into the shield or driving bag or the pillow. Okay, so basically what's going to happen now is you can explain, um, try to explain to them, they're going to hold the ball in both one hand like this. They're going to hold the ball in one hand like this. Then they need to make a fist with the other hand, put it against the chest. And they're going to charge with this shoulder against the shield. So they're going to hold the ball, make a fist with the hand, one hand, put it against the chest. Then when I blow the whistle, he's going to go, he's going to run. All you need to do is just lean forward. Your shoulder is the first body part that must hit the shield. So you're going to go down. We're well, going to hold the ball one hand like this under the arm so you can nice and tight. Hold the ball around the ball like that. Make a fist with the one hand, put it against the chest. Then don't turn sideways. Never turn sideways like this. Don't charge against the shield like that. Or don't run like this. Some of them attempt when they hit the shield, when they hit the shield, 
they tend to turn and then try to push with their back. That's wrong. Always tell them to face forward, face the, to the driving back, face the shield, let the shoulder hit the uh, shield to drive him back. So what you can do is hold the ball, then run, lean forward, and then push the belt, and then you use your legs to push the shield backwards. Okay. Hold the ball, go down, then shoulder in and push. Push. Okay. <coughs> That's the first one. Then you can turn around, put the ball on the other side, the right arm, left hand, make a fist. And to the chest, go run, in with the shoulder, and then you push the shield. Okay, right. Now, the choice the other way is, you're going to hold the ball on your left, left arm, then you're going to run into the shield, go in, try to get the leg, and then you... Really, yeah? Then get the leg, tell him to grab the leg, and then you must pick up the leg, so then they need to push forward. Okay, so we're going to do it slowly. So what we're going to do is we're going to go in, run, put the ball in, grab the leg, and then you're going to push them backwards. They need to try and lift the leg. Okay, that's the fastest way you can get a player down to the ground. Right, now they can swap the ball to the other way, then run, and go in, get the leg, get the leg, and pick the leg up. Okay. Right, here is your turn. First we're going to run into the shield normally. First we're going to test. Put the, the ball other one. Yes. This one, sure. Ready? And go. Push. Try to keep the bag a little bit. Here's them, and then let go a little bit. They must use their legs. Charge. Here we go. Right. Try again. Same man, same man, same man. Parents, just remember, try to uh, give the bag a little bit go. When they hit the bag, then you push backwards. Then you can start slowly moving backwards. Remember, they need to use their legs. Right. Ready? And go. Hit, hit. Well done. Remember, always try them to let them hit the bag as hard as they can. Right. Now swap the ball, yes. Ready? And go. Hit the bag. Go, go. Bam. Right. Push. 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 Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Use the legs. Use the legs. Use the legs. Use the legs. Start. Well done. Go again. One more. One more. One more. Right. Ready, and go. Don't turn the ball. Hold the ball on the arm. Experience, remember, they need to hold the ball on the arm like that. Go. Well done. Right. Now, for the other charge, they're going to try and grab my leg. Grab the leg, and they're going to pull it up and push it backwards. Right. Fine. Yeah. Right hand, yeah, no, can you go, 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 Go slowly, slowly, slowly. No, no. Don't, don't put your head this way. The head must always go to the ball side. Always put your head to the ball side. Right, ready? Go. Slowly. Go in. Get the leg and push. Trot, 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 trot. Hold the ball. Don't let go of the ball. Well done. Hold the ball nice and tight, Leo. Hello. Right, let's do it again. Slowly first. You can do it slowly now. Just remember to get that going low. Get the leg. Right, Leo, remember, ball to the, hit to the ball side. You don't have to run like this. Just remember, before you hit the back, get to the side, to the ball. Uh, slowly, hit the back, then get the leg first. Go. Slowly, hit the leg, hit the leg now. Grab it, grab the leg, and don't pull your leg up with your body. Use your arm, use your arm, put your arm towards your chest. Put your arm towards your chest and pull. Pull, charge, there you go. 
Right. Hands, let them try not to pick up the leg with the body. They can always just pull the leg up towards their chest. Okay? That's also a good exercise for the arm. So you can grab the leg, let them pull, them, let, let them pull the leg up towards the chest, and then start pushing. Alright. Uh, let's try the other arm quickly. Behind the green marker. Right. Ready? Slowly, Leo. And go. Start. Get the leg, pull it up towards the chest, and push. That's it. Well done. Well done. That's perfect. Let's go again. Remember, shoulder in, head to the ball side, arm around the uh, shield, get the leg and pull it up towards the chest. Ready, go. Got grab and pull. Shot, shot, shot. Well done. <laughs> Perfect. You need to work on your, your left shoulder a little bit, eh? Well done. High five. Enjoy. Alright parents, for our last uh, four skill exercise, what we're going to do here is basically the same like we did last week. I'm going to stand here by the red marker, I'm going to pass the ball to the where it's going to catch the ball by the blue marker. Uh, except what's going to happen now is, he's going to run towards this tackling bag. Then we're going to do the side step. We're going to do the side step for skill. Now what is the side step? The side step is when a player runs quickly and then basically they take a step to the side, that's a side step, just on a quick pace, so you're going to run and you're going to take a step to the side, right, so what's going to happen now, if you don't have a tackle bag, you're going to use any other obstacle like a chair, just put a pillow on there, so for instance if they do run into the chair, they don't hurt themselves, um, so a chair and a uh, and, uh, pillow will do, perfect, right, you okay? uh, go, run, well done. Let's do it again. Go. Ready? And go. Catch side step. Well done. Right, just fall down. Now we're just going to swap to the other side. Right. Right, parents, so what the best you must do is they run forward the tackling back. Then they need to take a step to the side. First you can do it to the left. Run to the left. And then we're going to swap to the other side. Then we're going to slide it to the right. Okay. Right, go. Ready, go. Run, tighten. Well done. Let's go. One more. Ready, and go. Run, tighten. Well done. Perfect. Give me a high five. Right, Ben, so that's all, all for today. Uh, remember, if you have any questions, just uh, leave us a comment down below or WhatsApp us if you have any questions. If you, have, if you want us to do, uh, do something specifically, just tell us. Um, we'll make a video of that as well and try to do it a little bit more thoroughly and explain more better. Um, remember, you are allowed to take a couple of videos of your kids doing the exercises. Just upload it to our page, Kids Rugby Training, on Facebook. Um, hope you enjoy it. Enjoy your day. Thanks.